What's that, housemate? We're all out of teepee? Again? Oh, hello, students. It's your teacher, Ty McCarthy. Here to welcome you back, well, kind of, from spring break. <laughs> and, as you know by now, campus is closed, and due to the shelter-in-place order, face-to-face -face classes are canceled for the remainder of the semester. So, everything's going to be done virtually from now on, which means we're not going to be able to see each other's faces. So I thought I'd make this video so you could at least see mine. Now, I know you've been getting bombarded with a whole lot of emails because of the crisis, but you should know by now that the course is online and asynchronous, which means you're going to be working through the labs at your own pace, and that means you're responsible for keeping track of your assignments. Oh, not you. Not you. Your organization's terrible. Your organization's terrible. Let's go. That means reading activities, lecture slides, and the labs. But I will be here to assist you. Now, a quick update on what to look forward to. There's nothing due until next Friday, April 3rd. And we're going to be starting on a new lab next week. We're going to be georeferencing an era photograph. So for now, just make sure you're caught up with everything and make sure to read Doc Rock's emails because. If you did, you would know that we're not starting Module 5, we're actually skipping that, and we're starting Module 6. So pay close attention to those. Now, as far as my virtual office hours goes, I'm going to be sending you a link to my Zoom office hours where you can find me. Um, tomorrow and Friday, I'm going to be by appointment, but next week, look out for information. I'll be setting up some standing office hour appointments where you can just connect via Zoom and meet with me, I can walk you through anything you have troubles with in the lab and answer any other questions. So just as a recap, welcome back. Um, enjoy this short week, it's only two days. And as always, stay safe out there and don't let the COVID get you down. Don't let the COVID get you down.